Toyota Land Cruiser 90 model series. It's a mini camper, off-road camper. Yeah. Um, we're driving through, we drove through the Balkans, now Turkey, going to Central Asia. And as you can see, as Liga is showing, we built it ourselves. So we put in um, some mattresses we're sleeping on. Yes. It's quite comfortable. Yeah. Yeah. That's very what you can see is uh, we build in some, some kitchen drawer on the right hand side. You make it? We make it ourselves, exactly. Yes. Just to fit it to our needs with a small stove in there. All the, the big guard, everything we have on top, we can have a look later on. Yeah, that's okay. In the middle, we have our boxes for the clothing stuff. Each of us got one box actually. Um, it's more than sufficient. Surprisingly, a lot of space. Expect in the beginning, and on the left hand side, we have about 40 liters of fresh water tank for showering or dishwasher, etc. So, I just put in two tanks of that, and then, of course, there's an additional space. You, you can put the water here, yeah. We, we yes, yes. actually it's basically full, but yeah, uh -huh. cool. thank you. Um, yeah, maybe we'll add some on the left hand side. What do we have? Inside, which is a bit of more space, so we have like uh, a fridge inside. Which fridge, is, yeah, a fridge which you can access either from the front side by removing the seat or just uh, with the slits here. <laughs> so you can open up all the lids and stuff inside with the different boxes. Yes, uh, refrigerator. Yes. <laughs> yes. Refrigerator, battery. Battery. And then ah, uh, emergency stuff. toilet, everything. Toilet? Yeah, yes, yes, yes. The dry okay. toilet. Oh. Very interesting. <laughs> and the car <laughs> model itself, it's uh, the Land Cruiser Prado Series 90 model. It's actually it's quite comfortable to drive. Um, it's one of the old benzene uh, engines. So a bit of a lot of fuel consumption, but nonetheless, it's very comfortable to drive. Uh, very heavy with it, we drove on road, off road, and very satisfied with it. So, and what you can see on top is it basically we put an additional box for like repair kits, for tables and chairs and stuff, uh, gasoline tanks, and as well the gas for us cooking. Everything stored on top of it, plus a solar panel to charge the battery. Your idea. Yes. yes. <laughs> yeah. what, what, well, what you can see here, or what you can see, uh, basically with these um, metallic tubes here, you can move it, move it out, take this panel here, and you have like a tiny oh, space for, for cooking and pushing. I see do many big caravans, tank, but uh, why do you prefer the, uh, this one? You mean like a small one, or is? Uh, yes. Yes. Well, in the end, I think we. <laughs> We're more more flexible to go to places. It's um, with big vans, which is quite quite comfortable yeah. to go in. But uh, you also draw more attention, right? It's louder, it's bigger, and with that one, I think it's more relaxed to to be somewhere where it's uh, where you can well, you know, you not draw that much attention from from people, and, and so so it's more comfortable and relaxing to drive in a smaller car and vehicle. And of course. You can also think go to more places with a small vehicle compared ah. to big vans, yeah. Mm. But of course, it's always depending on on the drivers or on the or the, or the people's needs and prefer preferences, yeah. That's uh, why do you prefer the is Toyota Cruiser? It's maybe different Jeeps. That's a good question. We also thought about ourselves. We compared like the Mitsubishi Pachero, the Land Cruiser, the Defender models. Eventually, we decided for the Land Cruiser simply because. It's uh, well distributed over the through the countries and over the globe. So if you've got any problems, it's uh, quite an old uh, model. It's now it has 180,000 kilometers, 25 years old. So if there's any engine or, or vehicle problem issue, we feel comfortable, confident to have repair stations and people help knowing how to repair it all around the country. Uh, so uh, well, it has been shown through a uh, quite a reliable car. That's no, it's uh, good enough for two people. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not too big. 
Maybe one baby? No. This camper for the young people. Yeah, yes, the young couple. Maybe. I mean, you can see all the live plays outside, right? You don't have really space to 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 really sit comfortable inside, so we need to live around the car. Thank you.